What's the name of this piece? Well, this painting is uh, the 26th in the series L.A. River, and uh, it is doesn't have a name yet, but it is uh, L.A. River number 26, San Fernando Valley. And how do you think about naming your pieces? Well, I, I try and name the piece the, uh, in, in a manner that, that identifies where it is because the series is, is, is a large series. And so for some people, you know, they, they won't know where, uh, they'll want to know where the painting uh, is from. And so I, I, I name the pieces that describe where, where the painting is from. Some people name a piece about, you know, about its serenity or something about the mood that it, that it creates. And, and uh, sometimes I do that, but for this series right now, I'm, um, I'm focusing on documenting the, the beauty of the Los Angeles River <clears throat> uh, as it is. Uh, it's, it's, it's not a place where very many Los Angel, uh, Angelinos are aware of the beauty of, of the river. And so um, I'm attempting to uh, document the river from its source all the way to its, um, its terminus in the Long Beach River. So right now, excuse me, in the Long Beach Harbor. So completed 26, most of the paintings are about downtown LA, and many of them feature the architecture <clears throat> that surrounds the river. But some of the paintings <clears throat> depict the wildlife. For instance, this painting. This painting depicts the, uh, the area of the Los Angeles River near Glendale Narrows. And it's a beautiful area. There's, this is the area of the river where it has a natural rocky bottom. And the reason the river has a rocky bottom is because originally it was put in concrete, because, but because there was so much, so many natural springs in the area, the bottom of the river broke apart and was eventually washed away. And so and now trees and all kinds of nature grows there. It's a beautiful area. It's near Atwater Village. So this, this river depicts the more natural area of the Los Angeles River. Now, this painting here, this painting is LA River number 24, and this depicts the actual source. This is the very beginning of the Los Angeles River. It's in the San Fernando Valley, in the area around um, Escondido, and the um, West Valley, West Ridge, West Valley Mall. And um, it's very suburban. You can see there's a high school in the background over here, palm trees, and we have the palm trees and the reflections in the, um, uh, in the channel. This is the Los Angeles River begins at this point, which is the merging of the Arroyo Calabasas and um, the other channel, which is, I think, the uh, Burke Channel. I'm not sure of that name, but uh, anyway, uh, so this is that, this is where the LA River begins in a very suburban environment. Um, and you see the channel walls and where the two channels come together. Now this painting, This painting is a little bit further east of the last painting. So this is of the Arroyo Calabasas, which is where the headwaters of the, uh, of the Los Angeles River begin in the Santa Monica Mountains. So this, this painting is uh, actually uh, not of the LA River. Uh, it's of the LA River uh, watershed area. 
area. So it is a part of the LA, uh, this water becomes a part of the Los Angeles River. And this is the Arroyo Calabasas um, channel with, um, in a suburban environment, you see there's a car up here and a, and a street and there's houses all along here with a, um, with a chain link fence. To, to get to this view, you have to jump a fence. Many of the rivers, um, vistas that are depicted in my paintings are, um, one has to trespass. You have to jump fences, kind of pass by homeless people that live in the river. Uh, there's a, a lot of places where there is, um, you're up, uh, they make it a little bit difficult to, to go to these places, but, uh, but that is changing. Many places uh, such as the, such as in uh, the, the Frog Town and Glendale Narrows, they've actually turned it into a park. So you can, you can go and walk down the, the river. Also, this is an area of the river where there is kayaking. And you can, you can do kayaking. A lot of people fish in this area. It's a beautiful place, a beautiful place to spend a, an afternoon.